praise the living God. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good, mighty Savior, mighty Redeemer. He's worthy, he's worthy, he's worthy. Mighty Savior, there is no other God else like our Father. Oh, mighty God, he is. Hallelujah. Glory, 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 glory. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless you all in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God on highest. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be worshipped. He's worthy to be adored. He's worthy to be magnified. We bless his holy name. Wonderful Savior, wonderful Redeemer, wonderful Great Father. There is no other God as our, our Father, our Savior, our Redeemer, mighty Savior, mighty Redeemer, His worthy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I greet you all in the name of Jesus Christ. I greet you all in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Please, I would like to have a word of prayer. Oh, Heavenly Father, the King of glory, Asians of this, and our God, you are worthy to be praised. You are worthy to be worshipped. You are worthy to be adored. You are worthy to be magnified. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to thank you, Almighty God, for your sons or for your daughters. So, Lord, my brothers, my sisters, Almighty God, thank you for their lives and their family. Thank you for divine protection upon each and every one of us, Almighty God. Thank you for your bringing us once again right now, Almighty God, at your feet, Almighty God. And Almighty God, we welcome you, Almighty God. Come and have your way now, Miss Almighty God, in the name of Jesus my father my lord yeah. and almighty god bless all your sons you wrote right now with your word in jesus name and on the sequence oh lord father hear them in the name of jesus right you are our healer and i hear your children oh lord the one in the hospital at home you are our healer hear them in jesus name oh lord my father put your word in my mouth oh lord and anoint my voice anoint my lips oh my god and I let me decree almighty god and let your holy spirit increase in me in jesus name i have no word of my own a hundred percent depend on you i am your servant father flow through me and i speak through me almighty god in the name of jesus christ to your son to your daughter almighty god and i please us almighty god as we are hearing your word almighty god father help us to almighty god to be to, to trust in you and hold on to your word in jesus name and almighty god we bless i bless your holy name i thank you for this hour this moment come and have your way father in the name of jesus Christ, father send your angels to to quicken your son's daughter that you want them to listen right now and be blessed by your word and i quit the father send your angels to give them send your agent to quit them out of right now for them to turn and join in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, any power that want to de de deprive the children that wants to stop, stop your children, not to listen, Father, mighty God, let your thunder from above arise and consume those power out of the, your children's way in Jesus' name. Father, give your children the grace to come in right now, tune in and listen. Almighty God, and be blessed by your word in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. I pray the blood of Jesus each and every one of your sons, your daughter, that, that are listening right now, the one that will listen later. Almighty God, I pray the blood of Jesus Christ, and I pray the blood of Jesus Christ for the answer of, of our prayers. So, my God, thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed. Amen and amen. May the Lord bless you all. And I greet you once again. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Mighty Savior, mighty Redeemer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Please. I would like to, hallelujah to the Lamb of God, we bless the name of the Lord, He's worthy, He's mighty, He's excellent, He's wonderful, wonderful Savior, wonderful Redeemer. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. We worship you. We adore you. We magnify the Lord Almighty. Praise Master Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Please, I would like to, to sing hymn, the title of the hymn, praise, of the, praise the Lord Almighty, Everlasting Father, please. <clears throat>
please, if you have a hymn book, if you have a hymn book, you can join me. Praise Master Jesus. The, the title of the hymn book, the, the, the title of the hymn, I Need Thee Every Hour. Hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus, hallelujah. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be worshipped. He's worthy to be adored. He's worthy to be magnified. We bless his holy name. Hallelujah. Wonderful Savior, wonderful Redeemer. Great Father. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. He's mighty. He's wonderful. Great Father, hallelujah. As I've already said, the title of the hymn, I need you. I need thee every hour. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 <clears throat> I need thee every hour, most gracious Lord. No tender voice lie down can peace a I need. Oh, I need him every hour. I need him. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to thee. I need. Every hour, stay down near Temptations know their power when thou art near. I need, oh, I need thee. Every hour I need thee. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to thee. I need thee. Every eye in joy and pain, come quickly amen. All life is me. I need, oh, I need thee. Every hour I need thee. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to thee. I need thee every hour. Day. Me thy weak and rich promises in me who feel I need oh, I need every hour I need. 
Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to thee. I need, oh, I need thee. Every hour I need thee. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. Ah, I come to thee. Ah, amen. Praise. The living God, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We need our love in Jesus. We need our Savior, our Redeemer, hallelujah. We need it. <clears throat> Hallelujah. To the Lamb of God, we bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. We need it. We need it. We need it. We need our Savior, our Redeemer. He's worthy. Hallelujah. We, we, we bless the name of the Lord. We thank God for God. We bless his holy name. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be worshipped. He's worthy to be adored. He's worthy to be magnified. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. We need our Savior. We need our Redeemer. Hallelujah. Glory, 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 glory. Hallelujah to the name of God. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be magnified. Hallelujah, 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 glory, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen, 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 amen. Hallelujah. As Father God, hallelujah to the Lamb of God, Father Almighty God has given me the grace again, once again, to come and then and I speak to you, my brothers, my sisters, and my mommies, my daddies, and there's one that's sick out there to pray for you. Hallelujah. It is <clears throat> it is God's way, it is God's way to hear you. Papa God wants to hear you. He sent me to come and pray for you. Please, all you have to do, just look unto Jesus, the auto and the finisher of our faith. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Just look unto, unto Jesus, the auto and the finisher of our faith. He's our healer. He's our healer. He will hear you. Almighty God will hear you. He's here to hear you. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Lord Jesus Christ, the, the time of oh, Lord Jesus Christ live on this earth. Father, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, he many people. Hallelujah. The one that came to him by faith, they came and received by faith. They left, they left his presence with healing. Before you will receive from God, before I will receive from God, you and I, we must believe that he is the God of faith. Please, you shouldn't doubt. If this God that I'm presenting to you right now, if he can hear you, he can. He won't hear you. He wants to hear you. All you have to do, you have to, to, to be willing and trust in him. Your religion, believe in him and trust in him. Release your faith. You might be saying, you don't have faith. I don't have faith. This faith that you are talking about, I don't have faith. Yes, you've got faith. Where you are sitting right now, Adibi, you don't have faith. You will not sit here. Adibi, you, are, you don't have faith on that bed that you are lying down right now. You could, you would have not lie, you could have not lie down on that bed. You, you, you'll be afraid that that bed might, uh, might fall and you don't want to hurt yourself. You will not like, lie down on that bed. You will not sit on that seat. You have faith that, they, that, that that seat can hold you. That bed can carry you. We bless the name of the Lord Almighty God wants to hear you. He wants to show you his goodness. You, should be, you shouldn't let the enemy telling you this God is not, he, is, he cannot hear you. He can. He's not asking you to bring money. He's not asking you to bring a so-so-so amount for you, for him to come and hear you. No, Father God is not asking you for money. All he's asking you, my son, my daughter, if you, if you, if you could just uh, believe trust that I am a, I am the healer. You will see the miracle God I am. Father God wants to show you his miracle. He wants to do miracle in your life. Please trust in him. Just, re just release your faith. You know, I am not asking you to give me money. I'm not asking for money. I'm just asking you, my brothers, my sisters, my mommies, my dad, wherever you are, I'm asking you, please trust 
trust in the Lord. Believe God Almighty, the creator of heaven and earth. He that created you is able to repair anything that is damaging your body. Anything that is strong in your body is, is ready to heal you. Just believe and you will receive your healing. And your, healing, your, your miracle, your testimony will bring glory to God. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the name of God. Please just believe. Believe. And God Almighty, excellent, wonderful daddy, will show you his goodness in Jesus' name. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Please, I would like to read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Before I will pray for you, I want to read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. He that did it by then, Jesus is the one that, that did it by then. He's still the same Jesus. He's still the same Jesus. He's still the same, doing the same business. Hallelujah. He's seeing the same business, healing his children. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. You might be saying, ah, this God, I don't know this God. This God, I don't believe this God. But he knows you. <laughs> He's the one that created you at the first place. He knows you quite all right. He knows where you are. He knows everything about you. He knows everything about you. All you have to do, believe. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah. Don't, you have nothing to lose. You have nothing to lose. All you have to you have is all you all you have to, 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 to you have you is to gain. To gain the goodness of God, to gain the blessings of God, to gain the healing that He, he promised you and all. He's healing. So by the stripes of Jesus, we we were healed. He said, I am the healer. The word of the Lord said, I am the healer that he led you. He is the healer. That we hear you right now. That he let thee. That we hear you in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. We like. I would like us to open to the book of a, the book of John, John nine, the book of John chapter nine, verse one to seven. The book of John nine. Hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord. His worthy. His worthy. His worthy. The book of nine one to seven. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I read in Jesus' name. The book of John 9, 1 to 7. And as long, sorry, and, and as Jesus passed by, he saw a man which was blind from his birth. And his disciples asked him, saying, Master, who did a sin, this man or his parents, that he was a born blind? Jesus answered, neither both this man sinned, nor his parents. He made a manifest, not, sorry, not his parents, but that the works of God should have been made manifest in him. I must work at the works of him that sent me. Why it is a day, the night cometh, when no man can work. As long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. When he ne had the doors spoken, he ne spoke on the ground, and they make a clean of the spittle, and he ne anointed the eyes of the blind man with the clay. And they said unto him, Go, wash in the pool of a Siloam, which is a by the tapetation sent. He now went his way, therefore, and they washed and came and seen. Praise Master Jesus. I thank God for God. Father God, Lord Jesus Christ, that did it for that man. It's still the same Jesus I'm presenting to you right now, wherever you are, my brothers, my sisters. The same Jesus that did the miracle to that blind man, he see the same Jesus. You know, many times we, or people might be asking, maybe I did something wrong. Maybe you did something wrong that causes sickness and diseases. It's not always, there's, no, it's not always because we have seen that cause to, to, to be sick. It's not always. And so that God lets the children and the, the disciples know it's not the it's not the parent, it's not the, the parent, not even the man that have sinned against God. It's not because they have seen that God is this child to be born blind. Praise Master Jesus. 
Some sickness, there's some sickness that yes, comes from sinning against the will of God, against God. But it's not all. We are in the earth, we are in this world. We are in this earth. The moment that you and I, we are living this earth. Somebody can fail and think. During, because of the environment, the virus, all this thing, it's not to let unbelievers that sick. Believers are sick, the believers are sick, so the unbelievers are sick, but I thank God for God that he lets. He wants to hear you, he wants to hear me. So we should not be thinking every time that we are sick, maybe I have sinned against God. Maybe you have sinned against God, yes, but you have to ask for sin. You, ask, you have to ask God to forgive you. He's ready to forgive you. You might be there right now. Maybe you know, you, you, you knew quite all right because you have disobeyed God, you had disobeyed God in one thing and another that caused this sickness to you. It might be you ask, to, ask for forgiveness. He's ready to forgive you and he's ready to heal you. It might be the sickness. It's not because you have sinned against God that caused this sickness. It, this sickness just comes because we are living on this earth. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. He wants to heal you. Please, I want you to release your faith. I want, I want you to release your, your faith. Believe in him. He's our healer. Compassionate father, he wants to show you his goodness. He wants to show you his goodness. Please, release your faith. You shouldn't doubt. He loves you so much. He loves you so much. He cares for you. You might be saying right now, because I don't know Jesus, I'm not a Christian. Father, this God will not hear me. Yes, he will hear you. That is why he's God. He's the one that created you. At the first place. Now my Bible tells me that uh, all souls are created by Almighty God. It's in the word of the Lord says that uh, all souls are mine. The soul of the Father, the soul of the Son, uh, it belongs to Him. Hallelujah. Even though you are in the other religion, you didn't know you, you didn't know Him as, as your God, as Jesus, the Lord of your uh, the, the Lord of your of your of your life, is still there to hear you. It's the goodness of God that will bring you to repentance. You want to know this Jesus, the healer. You want to know this Jesus that came and rescued you from this uh, sickness, from this pain. Uh, release you from this bondage of sick, sick, uh, the disease, the disease, the pain. Praise Master Jesus. Lord Jesus Christ is willing to heal you. All you have to do, believe in him, trust in him. Please uh, trust in him. Believe. Release your faith. He's not asking you to bring money. He's not asking you to come and sow seeds so, 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 before he will hear you. No, he doesn't need your money. No. The gold and the silver, the Bible tells me that it belongs to God. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. He wants to hear you. All you have to do, believe. Receive your healing. He's not asking you for money. You might be thinking, it's the one that asking you to bring a so, so, so money. Is that what pay? God will answer? I don't think so. Because God didn't send us to, to go and ask money for, for, for the sick people to tell them to so, 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 so amount to, to, so that we can pray for them that they will be here. It's not written in my Bible. It's not written. It's not asking you to bring money. He just wants to show you his goodness. He's the God of love. The God of compassion. Please. All you have to do, as I've already said, release your faith. He that did it by then and did a miracle, he did a miracle in this man's life. This man could see because of the goodness of Jesus. Then Jesus now healed him, gave him sight. Now he could see. He couldn't see before, bump blind. He didn't even know how his parents looks like before. He said simply, he didn't even know how to lose that. But I thank God, God came, came right now, came to him. God showed him his, his goodness. And now, you see, this man could see. This man could see his, in the, his family. This man could see, he could walk. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. He that did it by the see the same Jesus. He that had compassion on that blind man is still the same Jesus. He still the same compassionate God, gracious Father. All you have to do, believe and receive from him. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. I thank God for God. I know as you have heard the word of the Lord right now, believe. 
I believe your faith has been set up right now, set up right now, that you will touch him, touch Master Jesus with faith. Touch his, 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 the, 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 the hem of his garment with your faith. Stretch out your hand. The word of the Lord says, without faith, you and I, we cannot receive from God. You must have faith that he is the healer. He, he, you must have faith that he, you, you believe he can heal you. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the name of God. He loves you. He cares for you. He saw you, what you are passing through. You couldn't sleep last night. You turned right, you turned left. Because of the pain, you cry, cry, cry. Father, Lord Jesus Christ, I see you. He saw you. He wants to show you his goodness. He's just telling you, my daughter, my son. If you could, if you won't just, if you won't just right now, release your faith, stretch out your faith and touch me. I will do the miracles in your life. We thank God for God. We thank God for his miracles. We thank God he's the God of miracles. Before we pray for you, praise master Jesus. I just want to advise you. I just want to discuss with you. Just let you discussion. May the Lord bless you. And may the Lord bless you now for releasing, for stretching out your faith to touch Master Jesus, the hem of the hem of his, uh, of, uh, on the, the, the hem of his garment. I bless the name of the Lord. I thank God for your life. Please. I want to ask you. I want to ask you, please. Hallelujah. Do you have anybody, anyone? Do you have anyone in your heart that hurts you? You said to yourself, I will never forget this person. I will never forget this person, what this person did to me. This person cheated me so, so badly. This person stole from me. What I have lived but for years, in the trickle of eye, this, this person came and stole it. Stole it, stole the, stole my, 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 what, what, my, my, could be your money, could be anything, could be your car, could be, no. Came and stole it. I will never forgive that person. It might be that, that, what that person has done to you cause you pain, cause this uh, sickness to you right now, because you cry now and then. The grief cause you pain, cause sickness and disease to you right now. It might be, it might not. That that person has hurt you so much. It brought you grief. You said you will never forget this person. Until I close my eye in death, I will never forget this person. Please, I come to tell you, please, I come to beg you, please. I come to plead to you, please. Don't say so. You shouldn't say so. Because it's not the good decision you have taken. Because Father God says, the word of the Lord says, if you don't forgive, if you and I, we don't forgive those who have sinned against us, he will not forgive you and I. Right now, you might receive your healing, fine. You enjoy your healing here, fine. To your full age, fine. But when you finish, where are you going to spend eternity? When Father God said, if you don't forgive, he will not forgive you. So when you close your eye in death, so where do you think you will spend eternity? Eternity is real. And the word of the Lord says, Eternity, heaven, eternity, have fire, eternity. Both of them, they are existing. It's God that made them both. It's God. Please. You shouldn't choose to go where Father God is not. Where Father God is not. Is a terrible place. 
It's not your portion to even think of it, don't let us to be there. Father God says to you and I, if you and I don't forgive, he will not forgive you and I. If you have been saying to yourself that I will never forgive those who that hurt me, those who that steal from me, those who that, that manipulate me for their own good and use me, you say you will not forgive them. Please, you have to forgive them. Show them mercy. Father God wants to show you mercy. Because as I've already said, where Father God is not, is a terrible place. It's not just because where Father God is not, is a terrible place. Because God is your God. Obey him. As he said, you should forgive. Just forgive because of God. Not because you, uh, where he is not, you will not be there. No, just obey him. Because he is God. He said he has forgiven you. He wants you right now. He wants me right now to forgive. We have to do it to honor him. We have to do it to, to, to please our father, almighty God. The moment you accept to, to forgive, those who that for, don't do that sin against you, you have honored God. You obeyed him. And he will reward you. The word of the Lord says, I am the one that reward those who that reward. I am the one that honor those who that honor me. The moment you honor him right now, he will honor you. My sisters, my brothers, forgive. It might be your children that have hurt you. It might be your wife that hurt you. It might be your wife, your, your husband. It might be your relative. It might be your closer friend. Let your secret hurt you, cheated you. And that thing broke your heart. That thing has wounded your heart. That thing grieves you. At any time you remember, you are crushed. Yes, it's painful. It's painful. If I'm telling you it's not painful, I'm not saying I'm not saying the truth. It's painful. For somebody that you love so much, came right now, just from nowhere and come and just hurt you. You trust that person. You look onto that person. It, it might be a preacher. It might be your change, one of your church members. It might be one of your leaders. It might be your boss, it might be your co-worker, job plan or you, your co-worker job plan uh, to, 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 to sabotage your, no, your work in your working place. And now you are rejected. And now they have, they have sent you out of the work. Now you don't have a job. So you said you will never forgive that person. If I'm telling you it's not painful, it's painful, forgive. God Almighty will fight the battle for you. You have no, you have no power to fight the battle. If you have the power, you could have to, you could have stopped it before it started. You don't have the power. Papa, Papa God, the Lord Jesus has the power. You honor him, he will honor you. He will fight the battle for you. He will give you the peace. That the enemy has used them to steal from you for many years now because what they have done to you, you don't have peace. You laugh today, the second moment, the another one, you, you're no laughing, no laughter anymore, tears. You are happy right now. In the moment the enemy sees that you are happy, the enemy reminds you what that person has done to you. Now, sort of start again, tears. But the, at the moment, the moment right now, you you right now you made up your mind. You decide. You have decided right now. I will forgive them. You will see the peace of the Lord will reign in your heart. Will reign in your life. Now, no matter the enemy bringing the matter, rehearsal the what they have done to you, what they, what they have done to you, rehearsal everything to you. All you have to say, what comes in your mind? I have forgiven. It is well. It is why well I'm forgiven. Because now the peace of the Lord, the Holy Spirit is reminding you, forgive them. Let it go. Forgive them. Joy of the Lord. Joy of the Lord. Joy of the Lord. The joy, the peace you have had for how many years, how many weeks, how many months. It might be your relatives that have hurt you. 
might be your uncle, your auntie, your cousins. Forgive them. Show them mercy. And God Almighty wants to show you mercy. When you finish and they said, as you honor Father God, he said, we honor you, we honor you. Our God is a God of covenant. Hallelujah. He never break his covenant. Praise Master Jesus. Loving Jesus loves you. Please forgive. Let it go. And Father God will reward you. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. As you, I thank God for God. I thank God for your life. I thank God. As you have heard about forgiveness, I know with God all things are possible. I know, Almighty God, He will give you the grace to release that person from your heart. I know as He's able to heal your wound. The heart that is that the, your heart that has been wounded, has been shattered. Almighty God is ready to fix it back and give you the heart of forgiving. That you will look at them and say, I'm forgiving you. It is well. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I am so grateful. I thank God for your life. I thank God for you forgiving those people that fought you. I thank God for your life. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord will reward you. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. So right now, I want to pray for you. Open your heart. Stretch your hands. Stretch your hands right now. Touch Master Jesus. Touch him. He's there where you are right now. He's our healer. He's there. Just touch him. Let us pray. Oh, Heavenly Father, the King of glory, Asian, so they, Father, I thank you so much, Father God. I thank you for your sons and daughter. I thank you for your word. I thank you for your healing right now, Father, my Lord. I thank you for your sons and daughter, Father. You have, Almighty God, healed their heart right now, Father. You have healed that, that wound in their heart, Almighty God. You have given them a new heart right now, a heart of forgiving, Almighty God, a heart of loving, to love their enemies, Almighty God, pray for their enemies. Father, you are worthy, you are mighty, you are excellent, you are wonderful. What the enemy meant for evil, you turn it around right now for the for blessing to them almighty god you are worthy thank you lord in jesus name father i come almighty god as you said i should go to the whole as you go to the whole i want to pray for the sick ones i lay my hand on the sick they shall be here father i stretch my hand out right now mighty god i touch each and every one of them right now father that's sick right now in the hospital i hope father there is nothing there is no distance in the spirit almighty god touch them oh lord jesus place your hand upon my hand right now touch each and every one of them oh lord and i hear them oh lord father let your healing ray shower upon them right now and let, the, let, let your healing ray wash every sickness and disease out of their lives in the name of Jesus. Christ. By the stripes of Jesus, we were healed. I thank you for healing them right now in the name of Jesus. Give them the grace, Almighty God, to do what they couldn't do for many days, for many weeks, for many months, Almighty God. And Almighty God, I ask for a speedy recovery and I let them recover speedily in the name of Jesus. Now, Father, thank you for their lives in Jesus' name. Father, as you said, according to your word, you have given me the power to the, the power, the authority to burn a loose. Whatsoever I burn on this earth shall be burned in the heaven. Whatsoever I lose on this earth shall be lost in the heaven. But now God, I take authority over every spirit, every every false spirit, in the name of every spirit of infirmities, every spirit of sickness and diseases that trouble the children of God right now. As you are hearing the sound of my voice, I command you in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus, I bond you in the name of Jesus. I come, I command you to take to pack your bag and baggage and get out of that body right now. I bond you that I cast you out and right now, back to the hell, back to the Hair, but to the hair, but to the hair, right now. In the name of Jesus, I command you to leave that body right now. Leave that body right now. Leave that body right now. In the name of Jesus, as you are hearing the sound of my voice, I say, In the name of Jesus, I live. In the name of Jesus, it is written, You have been defeated on the cross. In the name of Jesus, Satan, you have been defeated on the cross. In the name of Jesus, my the children are gonna heal. It is written, Turn do my church, I do my prophet no harm. It is written, The body, our body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, my Father, I thank you for your healing. Your sons and daughter, Father, I give you all the glory, all the honor, the praise, O oh Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, everlasting Redeemer. In Jesus' mighty name, Almighty God, I pray, Almighty God, Father, as you said, according to your word, Almighty God, told no man, no church, I do my prophet, no harm, no weapon that form against me shall prosper every tongue that rise up against me, the judgment, I shall condemn, I condemn those sons right now in the name of God. Right? Oh Lord, my Father, any power, any spirit, any personality that want to attack me spiritually, physically, Father, let your tongue out from above, locate them, I rose.
rose them to watch them. Let your spirit raise the standard against them in the name of Jesus Christ. Greater is you that is in me, the heat that is in the water. I am completing my Lord Jesus Christ, which is the head of all principality and power. Oh Lord, I give you all the glory, I give you all the honor, I give you all the praise of my God. Thank you for healing your sons and daughters. Thank you, everlasting Redeemer. In Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed. I have prayed. Amen and amen. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. We bless the name of the Lord. He is worthy. Our God is worthy. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Plead the blood of Jesus Christ on you and your healing in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. We bless the name of the Lord. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you. Hallelujah. Amen. Please, if you're out there, you haven't given your life to Jesus, please, I would like you to do so. Please give your life to Jesus. Lord Jesus loves you. He cares for you. He loves you so much. Please give your life to Jesus. Jesus Christ, the healer, is, this, is the same Jesus, the Savior. He wants to save your soul. Praise Master Jesus. Please, I would like you to pray this prayer after me. Meaning, let it come from the depth of your heart. Give your life to Jesus. Let us pray. Dear God, I am a sinner. I need forgiveness. I believe that Jesus Christ share his precious love for me and a die for my sin. I am willing to turn from sin. I now invited Jesus Christ to come into my heart as my personal savior. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen and amen. May the Lord bless you. I thank God for your life. I thank God for you giving your life to Jesus. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you in the name of Jesus Christ. Please uh, look, um, buy a holy Bible. Be reading the word of the Lord. Look for a Bible church. Join the bread and fellowship with them in the name of Jesus Christ. Please tell your pastors about water baptism. Lord Jesus Christ baptized and he told us to do so. May the Lord bless you for doing so. May the Lord bless you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Remain blessed. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Sh hallelujah. Shalom. Shalom. Mm -hmm.